So in this video, we're gonna get ourselves over to Creed also. In our next video, we will be able to defeat the one and only Master Wizard of Prodigy. Right, yeah. Welcome back to the Prodigy video. So without further ado, let's start battling. Clank Boot, do you want to train in this arena? Right, so now over here, it seems like the first opponent which you're going up against is Jen, the Time the Traveler. Many students dream of traveling the world, and Jen is no different. What separates her from other students is that she's actually done it in only 97 days. So it seems like we're basically fighting against a person who has all pets, and it does seem like that they have a truckle, a trip trop. No, yeah. It seems like they have a truckle as a pet, so let's challenge them and get ourselves our 500 gold, right? So Jen should be an easy challenge. Alright, so it seems like they have both of the ivory pets. Now, I'm gonna give them mercy and not instantly incinerate them with the all-out attack. You know what, who cares? Let's just all-out attack them instantly. <laughs> I was worried there for a second, like, what? What happened? But yeah, it seems like we instantly incinerated our opponent's team and we can collect our stars and move on to our next battle. Right, member chest. Oh, whoa! What? What in the world was that? Okay, so that's what 600 gold looks like, guys. If you want to know what 600 gold looks like, well, that's what it looks like. Ah, now it seems like we're going against George, the curious one. You know, this entire title over here reminds me of Curious George, the show on PBS Kids. Right, so now over here it says, George has... George has a blooming curiosity for anything and everything. He loves playing with gadgets and gizmos, and often tests them, and often tries to invent his own. With varying degrees of success. Oh no, what do they mean by varying degrees of success? What did George do? Did he like accidentally blow up a building or something? Oh no, poor George. Ah, well, I hope Dream doesn't hunt him for his gadgets. But either way, let's challenge George, defeat him, and steal all of his gold, because that's apparently what you get to do in the arena. Thirty-two battle stars collected. Eleven member stars. Oh, fifteen. Well, that's different. And let's open the member chest. And that you guys can see is again what six hundred gold looks like. And now it does seem like Prodigy be lagging a bit, but that's okay. Let's battle the last person. Start. Oh, okay. So it seems like we have one, two, three. Alright, so it seems like we're three people away from battling Krios, meaning Krios is our fourth battler. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna end up fighting Aurora, the Ice Queen. Dun dun dun. Students came to the academy by many means. Aurora still takes the cake. She arrived to the academy floating on an iceberg, telling of her long journey across the seas. True or not, there is truth in her powers over the spell of ice. So it does seem like Aurora here is this Ice Queen, so she will have ice pets, so... I'm assuming that it's best to go with a fire squad here to easily destroy them, right? Yeah, let's challenge Aurora and defeat them at last.
mishear something because that's actually a huge amount. And now it does seem like we gained 32 battle stars and 15 member stars, so let's collect those and open the chest. And that is what 500 gold looks like. Alright, so it seems like our next opponent who we're going to be fighting seems like he's a titan. Seems like we're fighting Zane, the Emerald Knight. One day, Zane disappeared into the mountains alone. For days, students heard the sound of battles and green glow filled the sky. He returned wearing a mysterious emerald armor, which he claims he took from a dragon. Well, either way, I didn't feel like fighting Zane with his dragon armor, so I'm basically going to destroy him with an all-out attack. Right, yeah, let's challenge this guy and then instantly destroy him with a supernova! Right, here we go. All of the attack, we're casting it, let's just destroy this guy. So it seems like Prodigy does have a little bit of a bug which is causing it to lag backwards. But other than that, it's pretty easy and we finished off Zane, right? So yeah, now we only have one opponent standing between us and Kross. Ah uh, yeah guys, so now we only have one opponent standing between us and us and the final opponent. Now it seems like our next opponent who we're fighting is Nova, the well-rounder. Phew is Nova, the well-rounder. Alright guys, so it seems like our next opponent is Nova. Now you guys can read the description over here because this video is getting pretty long with me reading descriptions, right? So now, what I think is that I might not fight Nova in this video and I might hold it off for like two more videos, right? We'll get two more videos in the arena season. Battle right before Krios and Krios battle. Right, so now... Guys, I think that's going to be all for this video and I hope you guys found this video sort of entertaining. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up if you guys want to see me battle Creos. And I will be catching you all next time when Dr. Genius out the house. Bye and have a good day.